in today's video, we're going to be busting your Minecraft myths. Yes, in the previous Minecraft video, I asked you guys to drop your myths that you want to see proven or busted in Minecraft. And in today's video, that's exactly what we're going to be doing. Busting your myths. If you enjoy this kind of content or this video, please like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. It would mean a lot to me. And yeah, let's get straight to the video. Alright, so the first myth is, if you left click a random mob in spectator mode, you can look at things in their perspective. Don't know if this is one that's going to work, I've never done this, I didn't even know there was a spectator mode in Minecraft, but um, let's go ahead and try that out. Alrighty, as you can tell, there's our little character here, where is he gone? You can see his tiny head there, little Beetlejuice head there. Here we are in spectator mode, so let's go down and find a mob, or find something, and let's see if we can switch to their perspective by left clicking on them. Alright, we found a skeleton, let's try this. Three, two, one. Oh, okay, it worked. I'm in his perspective, so yeah, that is a myth. That is myth confirmed. GG. Alright, so the next myth is Vindicators will attack passive mobs if you name it Johnny. Alrighty, let's chuck our name tag in and name it Johnny. Alrighty, we're going to name this cow Johnny, and we're going to place the Vindicator. Alrighty, we're in survival mode, we're going to name this chicken Johnny, and we're going to place this Vindicator down and see if he does attack him. Oh! Come on, man! Go for, go for Johnny! Go for Johnny, bro! Uh, Alright, that's myth busted. This does not work. Alright, so the next myth is, you don't lose hunger when you're rowing. So here we are, we're in survival, we've got our boat, and we're just going to go rowing and see if we lose hunger. Alright, I'm going to speed it up, but yeah, let's do it. Alrighty, so we've been rowing for about a minute now, and our hunger still has not gone down at all. We'll give it another couple more minutes, and uh, we'll see where we are there. Alrighty, we've been rowing for about a couple minutes now, and that is actually myth confirmed. You don't lose hunger when you're rowing. That's crazy. I did not know that. Alright, so the next myth is Ted's can sleep in the nether. Alright, so we're going to go jump into the nether right now, real quick, and let's see if Ted's can sleep in the nether. We need to go deeper. Alrighty, so here we are. We're in the nether. Let's, um, let's chuck our bed down and let's see if Ted's can sleep in the nether. No. Ted's cannot sleep in the nether. Myth busted. Alright, so the next myth is minecarts can carry stuff just thrown in them. So here we are, we've got our minecart in front of us and we have a couple blocks. We're going to th just throw the blocks in there and, uh, and see if they do carry them. Let's go. Three, two, one. Oh, that one missed. Okay, no, that 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 does not work. Alrighty, we're just gonna try that one again. This time we're gonna throw something in there and push the trolley. Let's go. Three, two, one. Yeah, that's myth busted. Does not work. Alrighty, so the next myth is you can throw stuff through the nether portal. Alrighty, so I believe this one won't work. I really don't see this working at all, but um let's give it a go and alright. Three, two, one. No, you cannot throw stuff through the nether portal. Myth busted. Alrighty, the next myth is you can MLG Pro with a lava bucket. Alrighty, so we've built up 69 blocks and we're going to see if we can MLG Pro with a lava bucket. Let's go in 3, 2, 1, go. Okay. I'm in creative still. Alrighty, we've switched on over to survival. Let's take two on that. Three, two, oh, okay, we're going. No, you cannot MLG Pro with a lava bucket. Alrighty, the next myth we have is the Ender Dragon can't swim in water. Alrighty, so we're down under the water here. We're going to see if we can spawn the Ender Dragon underwater to see if the Ender Dragon can't swim in water. Summon... Ender underscore dragon. Bang. 
Oh. Okay, the... the <laughs> um... I really don't know if I'd count this as the Ender Dragon can swim underwater. Honestly, I think the Ender Dragon can swim underwater. The Ender Dragon seems to be swimming, so that's true to confirm. The Ender Dragon can swim underwater. Okay, the next myth to bust is Shears are unenchantable. Alright, so we've got our enchanting table here. We're gonna chuck our Lapis in. We're gonna chuck our Shears in. Well, so far, so far they're actually able to go in there. Alright, we're gonna count down from three and see. Three, two, one, go. And yes, Shears are unenchantable. Alright, just to test that that is not just a thing in creative, we're gonna chuck a sword in. And yeah, okay, yeah. So yeah, it's Shears are just unenchantable. They're just unenchantable. Myth confirmed. Alrighty, the next myth is sugarcane grows faster on dirt than sand. Here we have a dirt block, a sand block. We're going to place the sugar canes on there and see which one grows first. Alright, let's do this. Three, two, one. Now we wait. Okay, it's been approximately five minutes and nothing has happened yet, so I'm not too sure how long this is going to take. But let's keep going. Alrighty, this one is taking extremely long, so we're just going to do a bit of research to see what is the correct answer to this one. Alright, so that would be myth busted, because sugar grain, sugar cane grows the same rate on any pork. So yeah, that is myth busted. It does not grow faster on dirt. Alright, the next myth is shields won't protect you from potions, aka witches. Alright, so we've got our shield on, we've got our witch spawn egg, and let's see. Alrighty, let's get this, let's get her angry. Throw your potion at me. You missed! You kidding me? What? Are you kidding me? Okay, yes, shields do not protect you from witch potions. That is myth confirmed. Myth confirmed. Alright, the next myth is a bucket of axolot or axolotls works as a fuel in a furnace. Alrighty, so here we are. We've got our bucket of axolotls. We have some iron. Let's chuck it all together and let's see if a bucket of axolot works as a fuel source. Three, two, one, go. Alright, I'm clicking it. I'm clicking it and nothing seems to be happening. Nothing seems to be happening, yep. So that is... Myth busted. Bucket of axolot do not work as a fuel source in a furnace. Thank god, that's kind of harsh. <laughs> Jesus. The next myth is, my dad will come back with the milk. No, buddy. Sorry, your dad's not coming back with the milk. That's myth busted. Sorry, my guy. Alrighty, the next myth is you can MLG snow bucket in the nether. I feel like this one would work. I really do. Um, let's just head on over to the nether and um, we'll test that one. Alrighty, so we found ourselves in the nether. Let's go ahead and see if we can MLG snow bucket in the nether. Three, two, one, go. I'm gonna try that again. Alrighty, let's see if we can MLG snow bucket in the nether. Three, two, one. Okay, you can. MLG snow bucketing is. You can do it in the nether. That is awesome. That would help be helpful in. Um, that might be helpful in, in speedruns, I think. Maybe. So yeah, it works. Sick, myth busted. I mean, a myth confirmed, my bad. Alrighty, so the last and final myth which we're going to do for this video is if you press Alt F4, you can duplicate netherite. So we got the netherite here, we're going to quickly Alt F4 and see if we can duplicate netherite. Alright, let's try this. Three, two, one, go. Well, no. Can I fly you to the moon? Can we play among the stars? I've been thinking of you lately to control over my heart.